Okay, this is just a quick video to show how we can use counters to work out division in maths. So I'm going to work out the calculation which is going to be 53 and I'm going to share it between 4. Now to do this I'm going to start by making 1, 2, 3, 4 spaces for me to work in. So 4 uh, because I'm dividing by 4. And I'm going to start with the tens. So I'm going to use counters, but equally I could draw these. So I'm going to put 110 into the first row, 110 into the second row, 110 into the third row, 110 into the fourth row. So I've got 40 so far. And I can't fit this equally into them. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to exchange the 10 for 10 once. So I'm going to get rid of that. And I'm going to get 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10 ones. And I'm going to share these equally amongst the ones columns. So I'm going to go 1, 2, 3, 4. And repeat 1, 2, 3, 4. And we're going to go 1, 2. Now we've used the 50, but we haven't used the 3 yet. So I'm going to get 3 more ones. I'm going to place those again to my ones column. So I've got 1, Two. Now there isn't space for the last one. I could put it here, but it doesn't really fit because that one's going to be 14 and each of these is going to be 13. So this is my remainder. This is what I've got left over and I can put an R beside it. And we can see here I've got 10, 11, 12, 13. So I know my answer is the 13 and I know I've got a remainder of 1. Okay, let's try a second example. So this time I'm going to do 77 and I'm going to share it by 4. Okay, now again I can use the counters or I can draw them. So I'm going to draw them this time. So I'm going to have a 10 in this one, 10 in this one, 10 in this one, and a 10 in this one. So I've used 40 so far. 10 in this one, 50, 60, 70. Now here we've got a problem because we haven't got enough. So in this case, I'm going to have to exchange quite a few of these, but we're going to do them one by one. So I'm going to cross out the 10 here, and I'm going to put it into the 1s. So I'm going to go 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. I'm going to cross out the second 10. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Cross out the third 10. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. 10. So we've done the 10s, now I've still got 7 1s, so we're going to add the 7 1s in. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. And you can see in the first column, first row rather, I've got 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. Okay. And in the second one I've got 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, which is the same for these. So we can see the answer for this one should be 19, but because we've got an extra one here, we can move that there with a remainder of 1. And those should now be equal, 9 in each group, 10 in each of the 10s, so 77 shared by 4 is 19 remainder 1. 